Hi and welcome to Online Marketing 101's GMAS tutorial series. This is video 2, GMAS Mail Merge. So welcome to the GMAS tutorial on how to send a mass email using Google Sheets in Gmail. So in this tutorial we're going to cover the basic process of sending a GMAS Mail Merge email connected to your Google Sheets CRM from your Gmail account. So to start, click on the Sheets icon and a window will pop up showing your sheets and allowing you to choose one of them. All the Google Sheets that you own or are shared with you will show in the drop-down. So to choose your Google Sheet, the first step is to choose which Google Sheet you want to use from the drop-down. Only Google Sheets that you own or are shared with you will show up here and Excel files will not show up. So then you choose your spreadsheet and your worksheet. You don't need to specify which column contains the email address because GMAS will auto detect the email addresses and read the other columns in the spreadsheet to allow you to personalize your mass email with any of those fields. So here's how to format your spreadsheet. Your spreadsheet headers need to be formatted properly for GMAS to read from it. Proper formatting includes having the first row to have headers like your first name, last name, email address, and it's best that the column names do not contain spaces or special characters. So you stick with basic alphanumeric characters so that way the personalization will work reliably. And then the actual data will start on the second row. At least one column should contain an email address and, and GMAS will auto detect this column. And then to personalize, actually personalizing is really easy. You want to click on the settings arrow, this little, little arrow down here next to the GMAS. Now you don't want to click on the GMAS button just yet because that will send the email and I've made that mistake. But you just click on that little arrow button, the red arrow button, and this uh, window will pop up. And then you just go and click on the first name, email address, or whatever personalization you want to insert into the email. And it will insert it wherever your mouse is is on the email. You can personalize the subject field or the body of your email. Of course the natural one is hi and then first name. And then you compose the email just like any other Gmail. And to send you push the red GMAS button, not the blue button. The blue button will just send it through the regular Gmail and it won't be able to send all the different uh, email addresses you have attached to your spreadsheet. Now if you're just using your Gmail regularly just sending out one email at a time um, you can definitely use the blue button but when you're sending out mass emails that's connected to your spreadsheet you need to press the red button. So that's it. Pretty simple. Very straightforward. Gmass is pretty awesome and hope you enjoy it. 